Bradley Martin versus Martin Ford. Who would win in a street fight? Just take a mere look at Bradley Martin and Martin Ford. These two dudes are freaks of nature. In human terms, a duel between these two is akin to the Hulk taking on the Thing. And because the proposition of these two getting into a street fight is a mouthwatering one, like always, we will try to decide which of these two heavy built men would come out tops in a street fight. Before we get into the hypothetical fight, let's meet these two dudes. If you've heard about Bradley Martin, then you probably did so on YouTube, as that is where Bradley shares his incredibly popular workout routines. As you can see, Bradley is a special human specimen with bulky muscles and impeccably toned physique. This is one man you don't want to mess around with. Not in the gym and certainly not in a street fight. Bradley is best known as a fitness guru and an American internet personality thanks to his huge following on YouTube that boasts over 2 million subscribers and 300 million views. After he launched his YouTube channel, which he named Bradley Martin in 2014, the fitness monster began uploading his intense training videos, daily exercise routines, eating habits, and videos about his everyday life, which quickly made him one of the most popular fitness dudes on YouTube. Born on May 22, 1989 in San Francisco, California, much of Bradley's childhood is unknown. However, what we do know is that Bradley did not have a particularly pretty childhood. For one, he lost his father to suicide when he was only six years old. And if we are to go by rumors, Bradley dropped out of college just a semester before he was to graduate. But despite the difficulties Bradley had to deal with while growing up, he seemed to direct most of his energy into the world of fitness. At just 14, Bradley was a frequent gym member. Through the years, he has developed his powerlifting skills, added lots of muscle, and deepened his knowledge about fitness and bodybuilding. In 2006, Bradley launched his own fitness program called BM Fit. Through the program, he offers specialized fitness and training routines, as well as advice on fat loss, muscle growth, meal plans, and nutritional guidance. Bradley does not mess around with his fitness routine, training five to six times every week. He has made the phrase, every day is arm day, his motto, as he focuses a lot on weightlifting. Beyond his fitness enterprise, Bradley has also made a few appearances in Hollywood, starring in Boo, a Medea Halloween 1 and 2, as well as in the TV series Caught and Caught the Series. According to sources, Bradley is estimated to have a net worth of $2 million thanks to the revenue gotten from his YouTube channel and his other business endeavors, which include Zoo Culture Gym, BM Fit, and Origin Supplements. If there's anyone who can hold his own against Bradley Martin, then that person has to be Martin Ford. Nicknamed the Nightmare, Ford is known for his intimidating appearance, as he looks like a man that was injected with 10 times the dose of Captain America's super serum. Born in Staffordshire, England to parents Lorraine and Stephen Ford, Ford got himself involved in sports activities from an early age. He fell in love with cricket and even hoped to have a career in the sport. Well, that did not turn out as planned. Unfortunately for Ford, recurrent injuries made Ford lose interest in cricket altogether and forget about a career in the sport. Those years were incredibly difficult for Ford, as not only did he have to deal with crushing injuries, but he also had to battle glandular fever, an infectious disease that meant that he could not perform strenuous activities for a year, severely hampering his athletic career progression. After calling it quits on a possible career in sports, Ford turned to a place where he found a new love, the gym. Ford quickly developed a passion for bodybuilding and over the years built his body into the imposing figure that it is today. The bodybuilder carries out a meticulous and very demanding training routine as well as a diet designed for the bodybuilder that he is. Believe it or not, Ford eats six to seven times a day consuming up to 8,000 calories of mostly high carbs and protein-filled diets. 
In 2018, Ford signed in with KSW, the premier mixed martial arts organization in Poland and one of the most popular in Europe, having shown interest in combat sports. Like Bradley, thanks to his imposing presence, Ford has made several appearances in Hollywood movies, including Kingsman, The Golden Circle, Redcon 1, Robin Hood, The Rebellion and Accident Man, and more recently, Fast and Furious 9. Now that we know these two big dudes and what they are about, which of them would come out tops in a street fight? We're about to find out. To determine the winner, we'll be judging both fighters across four fighting categories, fighting pedigree, physique, skill, and improvisation, all key factors to winning any street fight. In each category, each fighter will be awarded a maximum of 10 points. In the end, the fighter who accumulates the most points will be crowned the winner. Ready? Let's get to it. Fighting pedigree. Let's get one thing clear. Judging by the sheer size of these two dudes, there's no doubt that even without any specific combat sports training, these guys will be deadly in a street fight. One killer punch to the temples of anyone from one of these dudes could send you to the ER. That said, these guys won't be fighting just anyone here. Instead, they'll be going against each other. And going by what we know about them, it appears only Martin Ford has ventured into professional combat sports seeing as he signed with KSW in 2018. That clearly gives him the edge here, so we'll award eight points to Ford and just six to Bradley. Physique. The more you look at these dudes, the more you are left awestruck. The sight of them is enough to give up in a street fight against either of them. But when put up against each other, these dudes would certainly fancy their chances. That said, there is a considerable physical difference between Ford and Bradley. Ford stands at an impressive six feet eight inches and weighs a massive 300 pounds of nothing but pure muscle. However, we should also add that he is 39 years old, a good 10 years older than Bradley Martin. On the other hand, Bradley stands some five inches shorter than Ford at six feet three inches and weighs 235 pounds. So Ford is definitely the heavier and the taller of the two, which gives him a huge advantage. And although there is a huge age difference between the two, it counts for little as both guys are in the shape of their lives. In this category, we'll give Ford a strong 10 points and Bradley, nine. Skill. We don't know for sure how skilled any one of these guys is in street fighting because we haven't seen them in one. But Ford's mixed martial arts experience should help him here, just about. We'll give Ford a seven and Bradley six. Improvisation. Again, just based on the fact that Ford has mixed martial arts experience, we can expect that he'll be better equipped to surprise Bradley from time to time. That said, being the younger, lighter, and shorter of the two, you'd expect Bradley to be quicker on his fight and have a few surprises up his sleeves. We'll call this one a tie, seven points to both fighters. The verdict? So with 32 points to Martin Ford against Bradley Martin's 28 points, our winner is clearly Martin the Nightmare Ford. Do you agree with our pick? Let us know in the comments section, and we'll see you in our next video. Thanks for watching.